Permacy. Farzine Dagon. Farzine. Uh, you, you, if you were here early, you saw, 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 uh, you saw Farzine performing uh, with a world percussion program that's create, that was created here at Overton as a part of Music Makes Us. You heard him performing this, uh, this, uh, with this group this morning. Farzine moved here with his family from Iran three and a half years ago to flee religious persecution. Uh, the transition to the United States and American culture was hard. Then one day, he heard a song, and his English teacher, Mr. Blankenship, is Mr. Blankenship in the room? I bet he's not. I didn't ask for him to be here. I wish I had. Then one day, he heard a song and asked his English teacher, Mr. Blankenship, who sang it and what genre of music was it? Now, we're in Nashville. Let's understand that. It was Merle Haggard. <laughs> Right? <laughs> Correct. His teacher gave him a CD, and Farzine fell in love with country music. <laughs> There's more to this story. A few weeks later, he heard the school choir practicing and asked another teacher what they were singing. It was Pavarotti. So he started listening to opera as well. Farzine had played an instrument back home in Iran when he started uh, he was about 13. All of a sudden, Farzine's passion for music was reignited, and it gave him a way to connect to American culture and to begin to enjoy his life here. Farzine plays Persian classical music on a bowed stringed instrument called a kamancha. It's not a Gibson guitar, but it has a terrific sound. Uh, he's performed at the Skirmerhorn as a part of their cultural outreach. He's done several clinics and performances for elementary age children in our district to talk about the power of music. And he even gave a TED talk at TEDx Nashville Ed about his personal story with music. The best part of Farzine's story is that he was recently offered a scholarship from the Berkeley College of Music. To study, to study, to study composition and music education, and I understand he got word this morning about an additional eighteen thousand dollars scholarship. Farzain, congratulations! We're very proud of you. He's also a finalist for the Thor Johnson Scholarship with the Nashville Symphony. Our high school academies are changing lives. There's, there's no denying that. <laughs> 